Imagine what'll happen if you don't even try. Hi, I'm Gawandio. Welcome to our channel. In today's video, we will dive into the private life of Kiawentio Tarbell, who played the character of Katara in the highly anticipated series, Avatar, The Last Airbender. Like, we will crazy. uncover five surprising facts about her that you may not know. Before we get started, please remember to subscribe to the channel. One of the most frequently asked questions about the actress is her ethnicity, so let's start by exploring that. The beautiful actress was born into a Mohawk family in Akwesasne, a First Nations reserve located on both sides of the US-Canada border, spanning the St. Lawrence River. The second most Googled fact about her is her age. Tarbell is a little older than the character she portrays. If you're a big fan of the series, you'll know that Katara is 14 years old. Tarbell, on the other hand, was born on April 28, 2006, making her 17 years old and a Taurus. Nonetheless, she fits the role perfectly, and it's easy to believe that she's 14. Another surprising fact about her is that she's not just a great actress, but also a phenomenal singer. She's known in the music world for her song, Light at the End, which is the soundtrack for the 2020 film, Beans. Like many names from the First Nations, Tarbell's first name, Kiwantio, has a deep meaning. In her case, it means nice morning in Kanyen Keha, which is a beautiful meaning. Katara isn't her first acting role. You may have seen her on your screen before, as she made her television debut in the third season of the CBS series, Anne with an E. Does it have a meaning? I, I love that your names describe the various characteristics. My name is for the sea star. Starfish? <laughs> you must be very resilient. What is your name? And her film debut in the 2020 film, Beans. Another question fans ask a lot about the actress is her relationship status. You should know that the teenage actor is currently single. Lastly, she and her co-star, Gordon Cormier, are very close. They formed a strong bond during the filming of the series, and Cormier considers her family now. Dio is basically just my older sister. We're all really close, and uh, it's pretty cool. 